Hey guys, my name is Moon, and welcome back for more Final Fantasy VII Remake. So, uh, yes, we are very near Shinra now. Basically, we are going to try to infiltrate it today. So, let's go. But, uh, is there any chest here? Before we go there, I mean... The door... Okay, nothing there. Let us go. Security is looking pretty tight. Huh. So they know what they're up against. Somehow, I don't think it's all for us. Could be for Avalanche. Or maybe True. even Wutai. Can't be for Wutai. What about the ceasefire? That only put the war on pause. I actually want to see Wutai in... What do you call this? In HD. Yeah. I want to see the, the models. We're here to rescue Aerith, remember? We don't need more attention than what we're gonna get. We need to be smart. Yeah, I hear you. But my soul's screaming for payback, you know? I'm a ticking time bomb. And sooner or later, I'm gonna have to blow up. Well, then make it later. Honestly, like, when we played Crisis Core, right, we were on this side, the Shinra side, right? But yeah, there were good people there in Shinra. Or, I mean, the, the infantrymen, the soldiers, they were good ones, right? But, then again, yeah, the leadership is the bad one. Okay, give me some mega potions. Do we need to heal, by the way? Uh, not really. Okay, can we buy supernatural wrist guards? I guess for Barrett, that is good. Materia. Sign Materia. I need a. Uh, what do you call that? Magnify. Yeah, I need more Magnify Materias. Can we get some of those still? Like, I want to put Magnify on Barrier. Right? So when we do our attacks, or when we... Yeah, when the enemy attacks us, I mean, it's not that much damage. But I think haste is much better when it comes to bosses. We need to spam the attacks. That one there. That's a Shinra truck, isn't it? Come on. Duh. <laughs> Are they gonna jump on it? How's it looking out there? Anything? Nah. All clear. Roger. Okay, head on in. <sighs> so far, so good. <laughs> My God, Barrett. <laughs> as soon as he said so far, from? so good, he fell no down. Holding back. Anytime now. <laughs> Bring it on. The idea was to not get noticed. Stealth ain't my style. You never planned to be stealthy in the first place. <laughs> it's over. <laughs> I can't see anything. Let's keep moving. Should be a service entrance in the back. Okay, did we uh, get more? 17. Okay. 
Okay, let me get the new material slot. But what we can what can we put there? Okay, cloud. Oh, it just it just became connected. Oh my god. Okay, they just became connected. I get it. My bad. I thought it was an extra one. Yeah. What's the situation? Can't get in contact with HQ. Did they do this? See ya. This won't take long. It's on you. Let me handle this. You're gonna feel this one. I honestly I wanna change Barrett's Barrett one or Barrett's Lightning. Let's give him the fire one this time. We're facing a lot of normal enemies here. Wait, where do we go? Oh the other side. Okay, we came from here, okay. No, I got confused, I got confused. Battles are getting chaotic and chaotic. Yeah. Like it's so hard to see the enemies with the amount of effects we're seeing the screen. Keep it up! Go in it! Clear! Uh -huh. 
Oh, Jesus. That's that. Sure hope no one else knows we're here. Come on. We need to move. Honestly, man, my eyes. I'm not gonna lie. My eyes. It's hurting from the... The amount of special effects. Like, when Barrett is shooting the, the fire, I want to remove the effects, honestly. I'm not gonna lie. Because he couldn't see anything anymore that much. Like then when clouds attack, when yeah, when cloud attacks, you see all the what do you call that? The slashes, right? It looks like he has fire element on him, even though he doesn't. Nobody's home. Yeah. Do you have any idea where they might be holding Aerith? I'm thinking a research facility. That make the most sense. And where is that? Upper floors. Maybe near the top. That's where you are. <sighs> Maybe. Maybe we can use the console at the reception desk to find out. Okay, so I guess we got to find a uh, way, I mean, to get inside. Monument to corporate greed. One of these it's locked. Tear it down and burn the rubble. But not today. Yeah, yeah. Hey, how do we... I don't know about you, but I don't think we should try touching it. Shit, making life hard. Let's just keep heading up. So, how do we get upstairs? Either the elevator, or the emergency stairwell. Isn't the lab we're looking for on one of the top floors? I vote we take the elevator. Okay. We don't have a key card. No getting upstairs without a key card, huh? I think we're gonna need a few before this is over. Pretty sure I saw one lying around. Oh, the reception desk. Yeah, but how to get in? Go up and over, maybe? Look. Pretty sure we could reach it if we hop across those lights. I don't know. I think I'll give it a shot. Huh? As the lightest one here, I figure I've got the best chance. You two can sit back and watch. <sighs> oh, we're controlling her okay, for the guys, first time. Wish me luck. You be careful. Uh, aren't I always? Is way too high. Oh, there's a chest there. Can we go there? Uh, oh, there she oh, fell. Shit. Are you okay? I thought I was dead for sure. But isn't the chest like a weapon chest? I need that one. Okay. Hello? Okay. We cannot control. I couldn't control earlier. It was taking a while. Okay, let's try to find some loot first. There's a chest there. Two thousand.
but we can go up like this. Isn't this the car from Cars? Okay, so there's a chest there. We need to reach it. Purple rain for Tifa. Okay. Fifty-one forty-one. True strike. Uh okay. How strong is this though? Speed is minus twenty-one. Much, much slower. But yeah, we can we can try and work with it. Let's see. So we can get this oh, critical. You see that? We got critical here. No attack damage though. No attack. Okay, this is more on critical stuff. 15 only? 6. Okay, 14. 15. And then HP, HP. Let's go here. Here. Attack damage up. Unbridled strength. That is nice. Concentration. I guess. Okay. 50% up. Limit break. I want that one. Critical hit damage. Maybe we can try this one, right? I mean, it looks like it's... It looks like it's good. But it's, it's much, much more weaker, though. But you get 66% or 20% uh, critical hit chance. Or maybe we can just get this true strike, right? We'll, we'll, farm, we'll try to farm this true strike and then we'll shift back to our fettered gloves. So minus 20 HP goes down by 1,000, though. And speed goes down by 10. I think this is much better. But we'll try this a little bit. Yeah, we'll try this a little bit. But yeah, you do get a lot of material slots though. That is nice. We can get our deadly dodge back. And I guess we can get some... What is nice? Warding? I need magnify. Yeah, magnify is the one I need. Lightning. Do we have lightning here? Yeah, we got lightning, right? Healing, wind, and lightning. Give me the lightning one. And I'll, I'll put the true strike in the shortcut, I guess. For now. So if we ever need it. Okay, I'll remove the steel ability true strip. There we go. But it's insane though how much a material it can hold. It's a hand lot of full hand, slots, huh? I mean. That's fine. Bring it on. Let me jump here. Okay, go here. Wait, is there no way here? There's no way here. I don't know. We're gonna drop down. We're gonna drop down. But yeah, what I want is a new sword for Cloud, though. Like, I think I want the best sword for Cloud. 
and I haven't found anything that's much better than the this hard edge, so I guess. Bad. Pretty close now. Just need to make it over there. Okay, it's blocked on this side. Wait, isn't it blocked? Blocked, blocked, blocked. Wait, couldn't we reach that side? Oh, this one is open, okay. It's kind of hard to see, honestly. Wait, it's blocked. Every side is blocked. Wait, give me a second, let me go back again. I don't know, we'll, we'll go here, we'll go here, we'll go here. I can see now. Here first. Then we go forward. Forward, miss. <sighs> Almost there. Just need to get across those platforms. Wait, can she even jump that though? I mean, I guess she can use a uh, yeah, this one like a rope, I guess. You know what's funny here, right? When we're fighting enemies that's flying, we can jump so high. But for some reason, they cannot jump high. Or this one. <clears throat> that's some fine work. I might be able to disable security from here. Huh? Ha! Hot damn, girl. It was not her. She's gonna say it's not me. But I didn't do anything. Shit, I'll take it. So you can use that to look up what floor the research facility's on? I think so. Give me a sec. <sighs> Bingo. Professor Hojo's lab. 65th floor looks like. Huh. Guess we can only get to the 59th floor via the elevators or stairs. To access any level above that, we need to check in at the Skyview Hall reception. 59th floor it is then. Mm -hmm. Right. To the 59th floor. You have got to be shitting me. <laughs> nope. We're a lot less likely to get caught this way. But a lot more likely to die of boredom. I mean, after the battles that we fought earlier, right? So Jesus Christ. Floors. Nothing to it. Well, at least it ain't a race. Small blessing. <laughs> okay, this is gonna be hilarious, though, if they show us, like, the aftermath. Like, Barrett's so tired. Like, oh my god. 59 floors. Wait, don't tell me I have to do this manually? Wonder what it's like up there. More security and restrictions. It's not gonna get any easier. We're gonna be exhausted by the time we finally <laughs> get to the top. As long as you pace yourself, you'll be fine. Maybe we should take a quick break. Come on, Barrett. 50 more floors. You can what? stop if you want. You can even say it's for me. Just say you can't hack it. I'll hack you, jackass! Ugh, that's enough from both of you. Stupid arguments aren't gonna get us there faster. But Tifa, I wasn't... 
Not now. Save it for the top. 13th floor. Okay, they're actually doing manually. I thought it was going to be like, you go here, it's going to automatically go up, right? And then I was going to skip. Hey, wait up. <laughs> He's getting tired now. 15. Okay, I can't wait to reach the top, though. Like, it's going to be like, oh my god, I'm so tired. But yeah, I guess in in the first game, if we did it like this, guess it's probably going to be the same, right? Shit, are all the way at the very top. Yep, the very top. That's good to know. Cloud, keep an eye on Barrett. Copy. What was that? I don't think I heard you. Speak up. I'll keep an eye on Barrett. Uh, thanks for the assist. But I actually cannot see Whatever. them anymore, though. But yeah, on the original game, what I did is I went uh, guns blazing, right? And then yeah, we fought a lot of enemies, I suppose. I said, <laughs> wait up. So you can actually do this, okay. You can actually just skip the whole, I guess, battle stuff. Hey guys, where are you? <laughs> hey! Just a few floors behind you. Okay, we got 30 more floors. <laughs> oh? You're sounding better. <laughs> Think I've got like a stair climbers high. <laughs> Glad to hear it. But they're actually making it slower and slower though. No, no, I mean, we cannot sprint in the the stairs, yes. I said, wait up. Oh, look, Tifa's right here. I was, but I'm feeling okay now. <sighs> what are we waiting for? Let's roll! <sighs> Dude, Cloud is actually getting really tired. Yeah. Better. Like, he's walking now. Look we, at this. We gotta keep moving. <laughs> <laughs> to keep moving. Woo! <laughs> okay. Woo! <laughs> Hard to argue with that. Oh, Barrett is Let's here. Go. But they don't want us to run anymore. Okay, 40th floor. So, any more floors? Come on, Barrett. A little bit more. Space and aeronautics. I wish we could, um, like, visit each floor. But, yeah, they're not allowing it, though. But tell me, these stairs, are these stairs ever gonna end? I don't know. Ask the stairs. I don't think the stairs are talking. Well, duh. I mean, duh. I mean, I was joking. That's enough from both of you. I mean, if, if I could go back down, I would have just gone through guns blazing it. But I guess the dialogue is quite funny, I suppose. Especially with Bart here. Okay, we got 14 floors left. But yeah, he's ahead of me now. We'll just see what happens up top. Because yeah, look at this. They're actually like... Not letting us run. Worst route ever. Give me a suicidal last day. At least, at least, at least that'd have an end. Let's shut up. Yes, let's. Okay, 49, 49. Why? <laughs> because wishing for trouble might bring it. Yep. And you're in no state to fight anyway. So. What should I do? Shh. 
Shut up and move. Okay, seven more floors. Do even look at Cloud. You can see him getting groggier. <laughs> what is this? Yeah, I guess once we get closer and closer to the floor, they're gonna make it slower and slower. For some reason. Okay. Come on, game. Why are you doing this to me? Like, it's just getting super, super slow now. Look at Barrett. I mean, I guess they're trying to make it realistic, right? This sucks! I want to go back! I mean, we're very close, Barrett. You want to go down all those stairs you just climbed? But yeah, seriously though, it's much more easier when you're going down. Like, going up, oh my god, it, like, it feels like it takes hours, right? Then when you go down, it feels like it's only like five minutes. Because how fast it is. Another day, another struggle. Climbing stairs, so much trouble. Wait, is Cloud passing out or what? Oh, it looks like it's getting darker and darker. Okay, we got it. Last floor. 59. <laughs> Cloud, slow down. Do we need water? Made it. The real challenge starts now. Okay, let's go. Okay, there we go. <laughs> 70, 80, 90, 100 percent, 110. Mako super saturation confirmed. <laughs> Why is he Engaging kneeling the there? Cooling to reduce temperature. Wait, that guy's kneeling there, right? Look at that. Madame Director, you have a meeting shortly. Stop. Your timing is impeccably atrocious. Uh, uh. Mako density and materia integrity are both holding steady. Registering mass increase in core materia. Now, show me something truly exquisite. So what is this? Uh, contaminants registered. <laughs> We're leaving. Materia growth accelerating, outpacing models. Registering crystallization within the reserve tanks. The reaction is out of control. We have to stop it quickly. Clean up the mess, would you? Ma'am. Dude, you can walk normally so now. this is the Skyview <laughs> Hall, huh? Bet this place cost a fortune and then some. Let's look for reception. Why was it still crawling there, though? <laughs> but yeah, it's quite funny, though, the pure torture hey, our characters had there. Out. Come take a look, Cloud. Very nice music. Very nice view. Damn fool. Ones who come here at night to take in the view. So pretty and marvelous and beautiful. But every little light burning bright runs off her blood. And bit by bit they bleed her. 
never stopping to think how it'll end for them. <sighs> yeah. Terrible, but beautiful all the same. So if we uh, did the elevator, we would end up here, right? Yep. You must be here for our grand tour. Visitors have access to floor 60, 61, 62, as well as floor 63. You will proceed in that order. By the exit of each floor, you will find a device that will allow you to update the key card in your possession, thereby allowing you to access the next floor. And now begins your grand tour. Please enjoy the Shinra experience. Why has this whole thing got to be such a big pain in the ass? I don't know about you, but this is kind of weird. You think everything's going too well? Yeah, I do. Think this is a trap? Ha! <laughs> if it is, then bring it on. Let's get this party started. Playing the tourist. Man, why we gotta get all these damn key cards just to get anywhere? This is Shinra HQ. The how did you expect? True. Says the former company man himself. Guess you'd know about all the rules, regulations, and red tape. It's like coming home, huh? I mean, of course they need a lot of security here. Wait, where are we going, by the way? What? Up? Okay, I guess up here. Yes, every reactor, every pillar. Like I said, a full inspection. There's no telling what kind of damage there might be. If you see anything, anything out of the ordinary, I want to know. Sorry to bother you, sir. No, it's fine. I've brought the damage assessment for Sector 7 you requested. Sir, perhaps mm. you should try and get some sleep. No, not yet. I need to finish preparing my draft of the reconstruction plan before tonight's board meeting. <sighs> Whatever reasons they might have had, destroying an entire sector is... It's beyond the pale. Director, I would strongly advise you not to say such things outside of this room. <sighs> Don't I know it. Who is this? So Reeve, we saw Reeve in the original FF7. That other guy, I guess we didn't see that guy, right? Yeah, the the bald guy with the I guess with the stash there or with the beard, I mean. Oh, a golden Shinra. to the Shinra building, our humble home. Oh, hell no! Here in the Memorial Museum, you can learn all about our president, as well as the various divisions that make up the company. And of course, the city of Midgar and the miracle of Mako Energy. Whatever takes your fancy, you're sure to learn something new. Yeah, yeah, shut up! Dude, imagine building a statue of yourself in gold, right? Hell no. Wait, I I, does I he like gold? Man thinks very highly of himself. Golden gun. <laughs> oh, I guess this is the guy that we saw earlier. Yeah, this guy. Bold with the beard. That guy. But yeah, who is that one? Nice pictures. Okay, so I guess we're gonna get some lore in this area. Hey everybody! How's the grand tour? I hope you're 
all enjoying yourselves? Wasn't it fun to learn about Shinra and our esteemed president? And to get a peek at the president's mementos? That was super cool! So I guess they're showing us the heads of Shinra here. Heidegger and then Scarlet earlier and Hojo. Reeve. Yeah, let's watch it a little bit. I just want to see. Okay, what's the game? What's the name of this guy again? Watson. Now, moving along, <laughs> the next exhibit will teach you about the important work we do here by giving you a closer look at each of our divisions. I hope you're ready to be amazed because you simply won't believe all the exciting adventures we have here. Yeah, on to the next one. These all look so familiar. Because we've destroyed a bunch of them. True, already. this one's. What? What? Uh, read Palmer, this, okay, this Palmer. Paper right here. Uh, give me a moment. Welcome to the Shinra building. The Space and Aeronautics Division has taken rocket systems developed for military applications and adapted them to a different purpose. The search for new precious resources in the infinite reaches of space. That being said, since we have plenty of Mako at the present, those plans are currently on hold. It's a bit of a shame, really. Soldier outfits. Oh, this big arm. Remember this in the collapsed highway? Welcome to the Shinra building. Urban Our planning. Our mission here at Urban Planning is to supply the residents of Midgar with energy created from Mako. We also take pride in maintaining public infrastructure, the pillars and railways that run all throughout the city. Currently, we are working to construct an intraplate expressway. When this project has been completed, it will provide much easier access to numerous locations all across Midgar. We appreciate your patience and understanding in the meantime. Look at this man. Like this one looks really good, right? For example. Wait, is that like uh, their plan to make Midgar in the future? But in reality, like the poor people cannot live in this place. Yeah, I guess the normal and poor people, right? All right, they're not gonna allow that. Like, look at that place. Everyone's gonna be underground. Yeah, the poor people are gonna be underground. The public security exhibit is currently undergoing maintenance. We apologize for the inconvenience. Okay. This is impossible, yeah. That is impossible. Impressive, wasn't it? I hope you enjoyed learning about our divisions. And the wonderful ideas and solutions that are produced to benefit us all. Here at Shinra, we strive to ensure the safety of all residents around the clock. What is that, like Mako? Yeah, we gotta see this because we cannot enter. Now, moving along, the next exhibit will teach you all about the miracle of Mako energy and our reactors, as well as the city of Midgar itself. So, come on! This is Midgar, our home. Recreated in one ten-thousandth scale. As you can see here, the eight Mako reactors form a ring around the center of our city and keep Midgar running day and night. The Mako which flows beneath our feet is a truly limitless resource. At Shinra, we have developed technologies to extract it and transform it into the fuel and electricity that powers everything we do. 
Thanks to the miracle of Mako Energy, our lives are richer and better than ever before. Mako keeps our lights on at night and made Midgar into the city that never sleeps. A triumph of technology and testament to man's potential. Nothing but a bunch of lies! Except that Mako has made people's lives better. It's made people blind. Blind to the cold hard truth. Even I used to bind to their bullshit. Remembering that makes me even madder. I mean, I guess. I mean, I guess that, yes, it, ma it makes life easier, as Cloud said. But at what cost, right? With the amount of uh, Mako they're pulling here, right? Like, I guess it's way too much. Way too dangerous. Congratulations! You can call yourself a proud Shinra scholar! Now, moving along, next you'll learn about our progress in advanced science and technology. Please proceed to the 61st floor, the Visual Entertainment Hall. Vis visual Entertainment Welcome Hall. Welcome to the Visual Entertainment Hall, where we showcase Shinra's cutting-edge technology. Through an immersive visual and audio experience, please relax and enjoy the show. Cosmos Theater. Okay, let's go inside. This place is empty. What the hell? was home to a people we call the Ancients. Many millennia before we discovered Mako, these precursors were already pioneering its use. Somehow they learned of the great reservoir of energy pulsing beneath oh. their feet. And once they had, the Ancients developed the means to harness this powerful energy and bend it to their will. The fruits of their labors have survived to this very day in the form of certain kinds of materia. Their scripture too has endured. We who are born of the planet, with her we speak, her flesh we shape. Unto her promised land shall we one day return. By her loving grace and providence, may we take our place in paradise. Alas, the ancients themselves are long gone. 2,000 years ago, a meteor brought an end to their civilization. But before their fiery end, did the ancients find their promised land? Even now, we have only to wonder. Times have changed, and the Shinra Electric Power Company is committed to changing and evolving with them. Like the ancients, we have harnessed the power of Mako. Are they out there watching us, waiting for us to join them in some blessed corner of the world? A green and verdant land where boundless Mako energy will provide for our every need Shinra is working for you to fulfill the hope of the ancients and lead us to that promised land. We shall not rest until our dream is realized. That was pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. That was pretty cool. That it? <laughs> Jesus, okay, what happened now?
Sephiroth. What is oh that dear. scene, oh though? Oh dear. A man of my refined taste running out of butter. <laughs> Short of its proper accompaniment, this tea might as well be boiled pond water. <laughs> No, it, it couldn't possibly have been. Crazy ass thing made me want to puke. And not just because of the presentation, but the content too. Ought to come with a warning. That ain't for kids. That wasn't just a movie. That huge meteor, what was that about? Like I said, nothing you should show a kid. But yeah, we saw that already. No, no, what I mean is, like, it seemed like a premonition, but, like, it's so early, right? Like, we didn't learn about the meteor in the original one here in Shinra, right? So what was that? Congratulations! You can call yourself a proud Shinra expert! Your mission is to go out and tell everyone about the wonders of Shinra. Next, you'll be visiting the repository for Shinra's expertise and know-how. Please make your way to the 62nd floor, the corporate archive. What the? Jesus. <sighs> Greetings and welcome, Avalanche, I presume. My name is Hart, and it's a pleasure to meet you. Huh? I've come to escort you to Mayor Domino, per his request. Mayor? The mayor of Midgar? The empty soup that's just a mouthpiece for Shinra? Yes. The mayor of our dear Midgar. The most magnificent city ever built. That, Mayor Domino. The Visual Entertainment Hall has been experiencing technical difficulties of late, and he suspected that these difficulties might impede your progress. So what does the mayor want with us? I'm afraid you'll have to ask him that yourself. Guess we're supposed to follow. The Corporate Archives. Look at this place. So what? You telling me the mayor's some kind of crazy bookworm? Okay, yeah, push. Push that one book that doesn't look like the other ones. Through here. If this is a trap, you're a dead man, you hear? Wonderful. You finally made it. <gasps> I am the mayor of the great metropolis of Mako. Domino, at your service. <laughs> I must say you three haven't exactly been discreet. Huh? I wonder who's been cleaning up all your messes. What the hell's going on? 
Come on, think about it. You've been caught by security several times, walked in front of every other camera, and scared an accountant half to death. Do you hear the alarm? No? You're welcome. <sighs> hmm. I can only assume your cell wasn't looped in. I am Avalanche's man on the inside. Say what? Huh. Is it really that surprising to you? You've seen where they put me. The mayor of the greatest city in the whole wide world, tucked away in a secret broom closet in the damned archives. The nerve. Those stupid Shinra pricks thought I'd just shut up and accept their treatment. But they were wrong. Dead wrong. Huh. Well, this ought to make things easier. <laughs> we need to break into Professor Hojo's lab. What? Why? You mean you're not here to give President Shinra his comeuppance? We're here to save a friend who was taken. But the President's gonna get his, too, if I have anything to say about it. Mm. <sighs> well, I don't particularly care what you end up doing. So long as it hurts Shinra. Great. So, I can get you as far as the 64th floor. Hold up. You're telling me that that's the best you can do? That is indeed the best that I can do. But you're the mayor. But you're the mayor? Does this look like the office of a mayor? I'm a glorified librarian, nothing more. They don't even invite me to their meetings. Sorting records and reports, that's all I do. My hands and fingers have more paper cuts than skin. No one knows my pain, my daily torment. They've made me a pathetic shell of a man. Uh, okay, they did you wrong like us, but we'll make it right. So just calm down. Deep breaths, man. Deep breaths. Hmm. Let me see that key card of yours. Here you are. You can now use it to access the recreational facility on the 63rd floor. And then what are we supposed to do? You look for a fellow Avalanche collaborator. Identify yourselves and he'll give you a key card to the 64th. The countersign is... The mayor is the best! Because the mayor, mayor is, the best. is nothing less! Uh. Everyone says he's cooler than the rest! Uh. Uh... Just say, Mayor, to the guy, and if he goes, the best, with gusto, then you found your man. You got it? You got it. If you think you've found the collaborator, say, you got it now? So, remember when we uh, first arrived after going through the stairs, the torture stairs, right? And then we saw our characters in the, let's say, like, uh, video CCTV, right? And then suddenly they disappeared. So he was the one, like, uh, cleaning that up, removing us from the videos. So, yeah, security wouldn't find us. So thank you for the mayor, I guess. If you require additional assistance, please do not hesitate to ask. So can you tell us anything about this collaborator? Certainly, I could do just that. But a man in my position must conduct his affairs with discretion. Which is to say that that which has been requested cannot be freely given, if you take my meaning. What, he's you asking for money? My... Disclosing confidential information entails considerable risk. Due compensation is to be expected. In this particular instance, that would amount to 10,000 gil. Rip us off more, why 10, don't you? 10,000? 10,000 gil? The 64th floor is reserved for our executives. The individual you seek is fastidious and well-dressed. This individual likes to visit the 63rd floor to decompress from the stress of the job. That really all you got for us? Oh, are you dissatisfied with your purchase? How unfortunate. Perhaps this will help preserve our relationship. Huh? I can. An expression of my gratitude and appreciation. Huh, that's better. He gave us a cannon. 10,000 gold or gil, I mean. Insanity. It's so expensive. 
firearm whose accuracy is dependent upon the wielder's emotional state. Hmm. 34, Big Bird, uh... Point blank? I mean, it's not really that good. When you compare it to Tifa's, this one. We, we didn't even try the Purple Rain this episode, yeah. Yeah, we didn't even try because we didn't really battle. Because we went up the stairs instead. My bad about that, honestly. We should have just battled, right? But it was just, it was quite funny just seeing the dialogue there with Barrett and then the others like getting really, really tired as they went up the stairs, right? And the game is literally like stalling, I guess. They were putting cloud or making cloud go slower and slower as we headed up the 59th floor. So I, I, I really like the video that we got earlier that when we were looking at, what do you call it? The Cosmo Theater, something like that, right? That was really cool there, honestly. And yeah, so we saw a premonition already. Like what, what is going to happen when uh, the meteor comes, right? So yeah, a lot of different stuff is happening in this game. Like sometimes like uh, parts of the game that we saw later in the original one, like shows up here or like not just shows up like information, I guess, right? And then Sephiroth as well. It didn't Sephiroth. I, I don't think Sephiroth showed up here though. Right? In this main or in the Shinra. Right? So I don't know. We'll, we'll see what happens with Sephiroth there. Because yeah, I think he was walking there, right? And then Palmer saw him. So anyways, we're going to continue this and do more of Final Fantasy VII Remake in the next one. So I'll just see you then guys. Bye-bye.